YouTube, I'm here from Blue Needle Studios and today I'm going to be giving you a useful tutorial on how to use the Notes application in Mac OS X Mountain Lion. So it should be in your dock, you can just click to open it and then it will come up like this. This is how it will look if you haven't changed anything yet. So you can see that here we've got the main screen, we've got a notepad on the right and then our list of notes on the left. So there's a few different buttons and things here. So the first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is make this window nice and big so that we can see everything clearly. Now the first line of your note is going to make up the title. So if we want a shopping list, for example, if this will load, we can just type in shopping list and then hit enter and then the rest won't go into the title. And then here down the left hand pane we've got a list of our different notes uh, we, we can search through the list so if we want to make a new note we can press this plus button down the bottom left and you can see that it will again come up as new note so if we want to do something else you have to make sure that it'll fit in the title you can do that and then you can type in more things again and so here we've got two different notes and so we can search through these if we want to search for shopping list, then this will be the only one that comes up. And then we've also got access to an extra pane by clicking this button here, which will bring up different notes. So I've only got on my Mac, uh, but many of you viewers will have uh, iCloud, which allows you to sync your notes between your iPhone, iMac and iPad, whatever you want, it's really handy. So if I just close this back by pressing the other button, we can come back into this shopping list button. We can see here this little sharing kind of logo. If we click on this, we can either send it in an email or send it in, in a message. And we can also press this trash can button and then it will ask us if we're sure we want to delete and then we can delete that note. Now there are a few things that most people don't really explore and don't know about notes. You'd think that really it's just very basic, but it has got a few um, really handy features. So if we come up here into format and then text, we can actually center this. So we can center this and have this still in the left. So that's really handy. Another thing that we can do is most of the things are in format. We can change the font. I like it in Helvetica, so we can have it like this. We can also choose whether we want it bold, so I can make the title bold. And I can actually make it bigger also by using the font menu. I can press command plus or command minus to make it bigger and smaller or I can press this button here. So as you can see we've changed a fair bit so there's a lot more than you would expect. There's also some different menus like edit, we can do paste, all of these normal things. We can even start dictation from here. Now here we can also share to email or iMessage. We can make a new note or a new folder of notes. If we choose to make a new folder then you can see that it comes in here. So if we want to make a folder about I don't know, let's say video ideas. Goodness me. Whoops. Okay. All right, video ideas. And then we can make a bunch of notes in here. So we can... Goodness, this keyboard is new. <laughs> we can make a bunch of notes in here about different things in that folder. So then we can close this again. So now that we've explored this, uh, there's a few more options in here. We can change colors. Uh, we can do, of course, italics and everything else. Uh, we can center it, like mentioned. You can add a list, and you can also do indentations. So in view, you can enter full screen, and here you've just got your different windows. So you can also enter full screen by clicking this button here. And then like most apps, it will come into full screen, and it's got a slightly different interface, which is really nice. Uh, you can see that we've got this nice leather. Um, so the interface is really brilliant. I'm just going to go ahead and come up here and press this button again to take it back out of full screen. And yeah, so that's my tutorial on how to use the new Notes application in Mac OS X Mountain Lion. If you enjoyed this video, then please like and subscribe. It supports me much more than you would ever know. And thanks for watching. Bye.